Imagine pouring a teaspoon of solvent into your morning smoothie. Sounds unthinkable, right? Yet this is what's happening when you use canola oil, a popular cooking oil that's often touted as healthy. The extraction process of canola oil uses hexan, a chemical solvent, that's not something you want in your body. Moreover, the refining process strips away most of the oil's natural vitamin E and carotenoids, plant pigments that are rich in antioxidants. And if that wasn't enough, this refining can also lead to the development of trans fats which have been associated with various chronic diseases, including heart disease and cancer. Now let's take a look at other oils. Olive oil, for instance, is high in monounsaturated fats, which are beneficial for heart health. It's also rich in antioxidants and has anti-inflammatory properties. Coconut oil, another popular choice, is high in medium-chain triglycerides that can support weight loss and brain function. And then there's avocado oil, which is loaded with oleic acid, a monounsaturated fat that reduces heart disease risk factors and is resistant to heat-induced oxidation. Flaxseed oil, a great source of omega-3 fatty acids, can lower inflammation and improve heart health. However, it's important to note that flaxseed oil is not suitable for cooking due to its low smoke point, but it makes a great addition to salads and smoothies. Each oil has its strengths and weaknesses, and the key is to incorporate a variety of them in your diet to reap the maximum benefits. But remember, no matter how healthy an oil might be, moderation is key. Oils are high in calories and can lead to weight gain if consumed in excess. So the next time you reach for that bottle of canola oil, pause for a moment. Remember the hexane, the lack of nutrients, the potential trans fats. Then maybe reach for the olive oil or the coconut oil instead. It's not about being perfect. It's about making small, healthier choices every day because those small choices, they add up and they can make a big difference in your overall health. So choose wisely, live well,